Hello YouTubers, today I'm going to walk you through step by step how to manually from the keypad program the UV5R Plus. Um, it's not that hard to do, um, but it's a good thing to know if you need to do it. What I'm going to do is I'm going to program one of my local repeaters, the 146 Two zero repeater. First thing you want to do is you want to go to VFO, put the freak punch the frequency in that you're going to use. Then you're going to go to menu 25, which is your offset, which would be minus. <clears throat> okay, then you're going to go to Oops. Menu. Going to go to menu 26. Make sure it's 0.600. <clears throat> then you're going to go to menu 13, which is your tone. In this case, is 118.8, which you can't see, I know, because of the light. <clears throat> then you're going to go to menu 27. and hit Never menu again and punch in the channel that you want to save it on hit menu it'll say receiving memory let the radio set till it goes back to the VFO you got your frequency alright then you go over here and hit your star key which is also says scan Hit it, that shows your offset or your reverse frequency. Hit menu 27. Hit menu again. And then hit menu again. Transmitting memory. It'll say transmitting memory. And just leave the radio alone till it goes back, shows the frequency. Then you hit your VFO memory button again. Channel mode. Go up and you go memory channel 118. And this is the end result. The frequency is programmed. Um, unlike your Yezus and Kenwoods and Icoms, all you have to do is put in the receive frequency or the repeater frequency and it automatically sets the offset you know when you store it to memory in this radio is totally different once you get the repeater frequency in your tone and all that in then you have to reverse it and put the duplex frequency in save it to memory and it's there but I mean really there's nothing that hard about it <clears throat> um, and it would be it would be a pain if you were trying to program a hundred frequencies you know or something of that nature 50 um, just to sit down and reprogram this radio from scratch uh, in my case I would have probably close to 40 frequencies to put in my fingers would get tired after a while, but that's a simple way to do it. Thank you for viewing my video, and hopefully there will be more to come later on. Thank you.